Oceans in Minecraft. Ha, <laughs> kind of lame. How about we transform this area into a giant futuristic mega base with a pit of all the mobs in Minecraft, which we collected last time. So now it's time to begin stage two of this project, consisting of the main structure of the build. So let's get to it. First off, we need to collect the materials for this. So we might as well start with stone as we have this thing. And with the cobblestone, you just put it in this super smelter and... Okay, we had no fuel, so I'm just collecting some real quick. I don't actually have a bamboo farm, so I'm going back to wood. Next up is a bunch of moss. Hmm, we're gonna need a lot more than that. Okay, it's time to start working on this thing. First off, we'll build the first of these giant stone structures. First one is complete, now on to the next one. We have a total of four of these to do. On to our second last one here. Let's do this. We are right at the top now, and all we need to do is copy this over from the other side, like so. This is the last of these giant structures to build. We're getting close, but we still need to do the inside of some of these. I have this handy little mod called Light Matica, which shows me which blocks go where. Yeah, this is an absolute lifesaver. I just look where they need to go and then place the blocks. Ooh, look at this view, but we do need to block it off. It's one of our accent blocks for this build, which is Deep Slate. Look at this, we have the main outer structure of this complete. Now we have to start on the largest part of this build, which is the stuff in the center. First off is a strip of lime green glass in as much of a circle you can make in Minecraft. Now for a ring of frog lights behind the glass. Oop, whoops. Ayo, hey since when is this a thing? I can just right click and it'll place a block like wherever, what? If I have it in my inventory, it'll just place it. This is a lot of moss. I'm gonna make it so you can fly through the entire base. So that's what I'm doing right now. Back to doing this, but on the next layer. Well, at least it's pretty satisfying. I have to cover this entire thing with moss, so let me just... Yes! I'm, I'm actually surprised that worked. Right, let's do this. Oh my gosh, why is this thing such a death trap? Now look at the progress on this thing, it is really taking shape already. But we have a lot more of this moss to do, so let's get back to it. Now to complete these central things. I'm building another one of these rings, but I just have to copy it from the other one above. Now for another one of these moss borders. Another stone border. And fill all this with moss. Now to finish off this bottom layer. There's a lot of this moss to do, as always. Let's just get this done. Hey, 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 get, get down there. Ah ha ha. 
Oh, he has a lot of mates, doesn't he? Look, look at this. Oh my. Oh, there's so much of this. Still going, still going, still going. The last ring of moss. Now I just popped down here to the bottom of this and look at it, oh my. And this isn't even done, only part of the lighting is complete. <laughs> right, back to the moss. Moss is actually complete. Now just onto finishing these paths. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, there's, there's so many mobs, there's so many mobs. Quick, mind that. No, it's in the wrong place. No. Oh my goodness me, I'm so. Yes, get out. I want a pocket pine. Okay, come on. Creeper, no. Yes, yes. We got it, we got it, we got it. Almost done. And the final blocks. And we have done it. We have transformed this ocean into this massive futuristic garden build, which in the future will be filled with builds to act as my mega base. A lot of work goes into this, so liking and subscribing would be much appreciated, but I'll see you next time.